the feedback loop. What you currently experience as reality could be viewed as a feedback loop of what you formerly believed. The more unaware you are, the more you label this feedback loop as a factual reality. One might consciously intend the reality, I am rich. This is then created to 100% on the entire timeline. Now, if his surroundings and circumstances seem to provide counter evidence to his new decision, this is merely a feedback loop to his old decisions. It is in how he reacts to these that determines if he is really resting in his new viewpoint or lets himself get talked back into the old one. For example, some bank account statement turns up that shows how the account is overdrawn and he says, well, maybe I'm not that rich after all. Here's the proof. What he is doing here is he is leaving his new viewpoint and letting outside circumstances dictate his being rather than his dictating the outside circumstances. He has just fallen back into slave mentality. It is therefore important to remain poised in the new viewpoint, no matter what outside evidence is showing you. The poor spirited will use any opportunity and any shred of outside evidence as an excuse, a reason to fall back into his old identity. The reality surfer or wizard or creator will use counter evidence as something to remind him of his new reality as a confirmation of his new reality. Ah, here comes evidence corresponding to my old identity. This is a wonderful opportunity to confirm my new identity. Because this is happening, I can adjust my reaction so that it corresponds to my new identity. How wonderful! You see, he is using the counter evidence to deepen his new identity. This may be the way things are for the moment, but it is no longer the way you are.